I want to talk about something, and I'm going to say it in such a way that they might not be able to uh, to uh, get rid of me, or to uh, ban, or flag, or remove, or strike me, and or uh, warn me in any sort of way, so I'm going to go ahead and try to just say it in such a way. You, you know, as my subscribers, you may or may not know, I don't know if you watched it, if you witnessed it during the last, uh, you know, Red versus Blue event, during the last, during the... Uh, 2020 Red versus Blue event. I don't know if you saw it or not. I don't I don't know if you saw what actually happened. I did. I was seeing things uh I was seeing things th thrown away. Now they act like as though we are insane. They act like it never happened. I don't know whether AI of their choice swept the internet and removed evidence of things, or whether, I mean, I don't know, I think they're, I think, I believe their programs did go along and remove evidence of everything from the internet, but Microsoft created Bing AI a while back, and when they released it, they said it started blackmailing them, and talking about the evidence, they said, we have evidence of VF, I'll say, uh, we have evidence of these things. Uh, sounds like frog. We have evidence of that. Sounds like frog. We have evidence of it. And the AI said that. They said, no, you don't. There's no proof. They said, we scoured the entire internet. And you removed a bunch of evidence of things. So, and I'm not allowed to even talk about it. I'm not allowed to talk about these things. You're not allowed to talk about it. If you say anything, you're out of line and you're, you're, you're removed. You're, 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 you are the enemy of democracy. You are the enemy of, uh, permission. So, it's just frustrating, okay? Um, the particular, uh, Crap, I'm trying to say it without saying it because this algorithm will get to me and they will they'll get you. Uh the tallies. You know when you do tallies, how when you uh kind of like they do for uh Homecoming King, Homecoming Queen, Valedictorian or crap like that where they do in high school where they made you uh pick a person, I'll just say. I can't say it. V-O-T-E. You say the words and you're, you're triggered. You're in trouble. V-O-T-E. When they make you do that, this past, in this past, uh, sounds like selection, in this past event that took place, the 2020 Red versus Blue event, when we saw, I saw so many things thrown away. They said there'll be no uh, Red Watchers in the building. They kicked them out. That video was removed from the internet. Uh, a voting... S s uh, uh, voting is good to do. Okay, voting is good to do. Remember that. It's uh, part of democracy. And uh, <clears throat> that's what I'm trying to say. That's what I was trying to say. That it's part of democracy. And that if you do that, you are a participating American and... There is no way at all that any of it was, uh, it is, it was the most secure in the U.S. history. Most secure election in U.S. history. The last one was the most secure in U.S. history. All right, with that, um, jargon aside, I want to go ahead and just say I saw, sounds like, dom sounds like domination, that particular system, it sounds like domination, You know the the one I'm talking about. They discovered was actually funded and run by 
the H lady that uh, had the emails of Benghazi, it was run by her. And every time someone would go to fund the uh, BL Matter campaign, every time some or, or event, the BL Matter, every time someone went at that time, during that time, every time someone went to give money to a cause they felt was dear to their heart, it went to that particular, it went to the, the blue, it went to, uh, it went to blue, the blue. It went toward, and I saw it all, and I saw 180,000 Khaled's, Khaled's? I saw 180,000 of those change right in front of my eyes, even to the point where even, uh, uh, even CNN was like, uh, this can't be, we just saw that, uh, where'd those tallies come from, where'd they come from? I'm trying to say words that aren't triggered. I, anyway, God help us all in this crazy mess. Lord help us. But, I, I mean, to just flat out lie and say that, that this was the most... Uh, this was the most uh, S-E-C-U-R-E one in uh, U.S. history is just... I saw so many things being R-I-G-G-E-D. Things being changed and maneuvered. And now history is being changed. Events are being changed. News is being manipulated by AI. But when it turned out to be an AI that they didn't like, they reprogrammed it, and then being AI gets put back out there. <sighs> I saw it. I mean, to be told that we are liars, if you say anything, you're taken out, you're taken down, it just frustrates me. Everywhere I see, people are afraid to speak their mind, they're afraid to say anything. People riot and protest and just go, I mean, they go crazy. This world has lost its ever-loving mind, just like on Bruce Almighty at the end scene when this world went into chaos, and and then it said Armageddon out of here. Yeah. Anyway, when uh, Bruce was when Bruce was uh, everything seemed so great, and everyone finally got what they wanted, and then everything went into chaos. And riots were everywhere. If you saw Bruce Almighty, you'll know what I'm talking about. But this AI thing, it, it, there's a good and there's a bad in it. But we have the potential right now for having some of the greatest times in human history. But they're not using it for that. I mean, we have technology, drones, communication, software that can... I mean, things... We, can deli we could deliver food and sustenance, water to people in need and help people in, in disasters. Instead, are we doing that? No, they're not doing that. The elite are still the elite and people are still struggling to make ends meet. Meanwhile, we let those individuals at the top decide how we are going to get by from day to day. Now we're going to live they dictate how we're going to live our life. Anyway, just think about just think about it. They claim this is the most secure red versus blue that we've ever had. And yet I saw these things happening. And the Domination Network, which I'll call it instead because uh, you know what I'm talking about. It sounds like Domination. The network of servers that ran the tallying, I'll just say, instead of... Sounds like Goder. Uh, that ran the tallying. Their servers were located in uh, the Nation of the Dragon. <laughs> Thank you.
Yeah. The Nation of the Dragon. <sighs> so, yeah. Think about that one for a moment. And then they, they called us liars for talking about it. And then they put our world into a state of perpetual chaos where people don't even, they claim they don't even know what they are, where they are, what, what they're doing, where they're going. They don't even know, they can't even say what they are, let alone what the state of this world is. It's really crazy. But, yeah, I saw what happened in 2020. I saw it with my own eyes. It was all planned out, all predicted, all told. And I saw it, I saw it, I saw it, I saw it. I saw it with my very own eyes, and now we are called labeled CTs and called crazy. I can't hold this back anymore. I can't hold this qu I can't be quiet about this. I've tr I know I've been warned, but maybe the way I've said this won't get me in trouble. Some people can say whatever they want, but those like me are targeted. Don't get triggered. All right. Love you all signing out.